if you have an intention and there's something you want to accomplish, you send it to your heart and you ask the heart to cohere it into the right state. So that manifestation becomes possible. But when you want to work with manifestation from heart wisdom, always add and in a way that is aligned with the wisdom of life. Because if we are just wanting things to happen again, and we're acting in disconnection with that fundamental unity and interdependence that we spoke of in the beginning, that's why we try to to grab things and make things happen from the field, but we're not, we are then not in coherence with the field. And that is ego and shadow. Ego, ego dynamic means that uh, there's a part within ourselves that has become dominant, that is imposing its own agenda and starts to direct resources for the achievement of its own agendas. But if we're trusting that that unity and that wholeness wants what's best for us, there's no need to do that. There's, there's no need to impose. <laughs> so when you're working with intentions, also give it again to the wisdom of the higher heart to show you how you may best bring this into the world, into fruition, into manifestation in a way that's for the highest good of life and everyone involved.